Hello friends, Tony here. Uh, today is Sunday and I'm going to take a look at this uh, filament starter project created by the log so you can find in the github.com slash log 1x slash filament dash starter. Okay, this is going to be kind of a live video. I haven't touched this project before. So let's read the filament starter here. Life's a beautiful starting point to quickly bootstrap your next tall stack application utilizing the filament for the admin panel. Okay, then we have some features here as you can see. Quick, clean starting point with an example post model and resource. Fully pre-configured and customized filament panel with best practices. Clean, minimally styled frontend powered by Livewire, Talune CSS and Vita ready. Uh, pre-bundled live wire and alpine js spa ready in both filament and front end github actions and easy seo okay we have also some requirements so make sure all the dependencies have been installed before moving on we need to have php 8.1 or 8.2 or 8.3 in my case i have the 8, 8. Uh, Three and also the 8.2 node.js greater than 18 and if I open here and say node version I have version 20 and the yarn also I have yarn in my machine okay now let's get started and let's uh, copy this command And I'm going to navigate first in my code directory and here I'm going to create this. So composer create project and the name of the package which is log1x slash filament dash starter. Hit enter. Okay, I'm going to open also the db engine and here i'm going to create a new database and let's say uh, filament starter so i'm going to say filament underscore starter okay let's create that and let's open and now i'm going to navigate so cd to filament starter and I'm going to open this with the VS code. Let's open here. So after we see the in the filament starter, after the .env is configured, you can proceed to migrate and see the database. So let's copy this. First, let's open here the .env file. And we have the filament underscore starter, the same I have created. The username is root and the password is empty in my case. So I am okay, just I want to run this PHP artisan migrate fresh dash dash seed, hit enter, everything good, let's clean and let's, so on the database is see that you can log into slash admin using the default admin user. So username is admin and the password is admin. Also let's run the yarn install and yarn build. So let's open. Here I'm going to say yarn install. Okay, and also the yarn a bit. Hit under. Okay, I'm going to clean and I'm going to open now the project. So on new tab, I'm going to say filament dash starter dot test hit enter and here is the project as you can see we have some posts here next we can go to post and see the post details okay if i click the login we have navigate the slash admin slash login and the username is admin and also the password is admin and i'm going to sign in here
and here is our filament starter. So we have collection posts, also we have some cards, we have users, we have also media library, we have some settings, so exceptions, jobs and activity log. And as you can see also we have the Laravel debug bar installed. So on the post, for example, we can edit this post. As you can see, we have markdown, view the post, delete, preview, add media and so on. Okay, one more thing, let's show you here in the app, we have filament. And here we have auth, we have the login, also we have resources. And here we have a post resource, a user resource, or the post resource that we have here. Navigation sort, we get navigation bits. We have a form, also the user resource here. And you can see you by yourself using the best practices on the filament. Okay friends, that's it all about this video. I just wanted to show you this nice package from the log 1x Brandon, which is very helpful to start a new filament or a new tal stack project. All the best and if you like such videos, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like the video, share with your friends and see you in the next one. All the best. Thank you very much.